Growing, sharing, trying to find our way in this new world we found. We're not children now. Teaching, we're learning, living for today or tomorrow. We'll show them all the way to the bar. City, bar, city, bar, city cafe, where the good times are. Everyone's a star at the bar. City, bar, city, bar, city cafe, where the good times are. Here at the bar, city cafe. There's no lunatics here, just Miles. Only Miles. Well, what are you doing here, Miles? Oh, I had this incredible dream, and I felt the need to put it on canvas. Well, we were just at the library studying dream analysis. Yeah, and that jerk Adam wouldn't even give us a ride home. Really? What's your analysis? Your analysis? <laughs> uh, it's when the doctor gives you a little glass jar. I'm trying to capture thoughts, feelings, emotions. What do you think? Well, Miles, my good fellow, based on this painting, you're a real deviant. <laughs> says who? Freud. Artists are the worst. Freud says you're all neurotic. Yeah, well, he's dead. <laughs> well, huh? see here. You desire fame, power, wealth, the love of women, but the lack of means of achieving them. And like any other unsatisfied man, you transfer your desires to fantasy, and before you know it, you're on the next bus to Bellevue. And see here, these S-curves represent babes. <laughs> All these little dancing eggplants. Mm -hmm. and, and, and these in these bold up and down brush strokes. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. That's Miles pent up sexual tension. Oh, no, no. This dream was about little children frolicking in a meadow. Children? You're sick. <laughs> they were big children. Uh-huh. And what were they wearing? Pajamas. <laughs> with little flaps in the back. Oh, that's <laughs> disgusting. Thank you, Dr. Seuss. Jeff's psychoanalysis is not green eggs and ham. But I'm a pro, ma'am. Yes, I am. <laughs> You're barely passing intro to psych, okay? You can't just waltz in here and give Miles an analysis of his dream based on this. What do you know, anyway? I know that Miles is poor and unsuccessful. Are you desperate, sir? Desperate? There you have it. Anyway, if you don't believe me, ask Keith or Adam. They're in my class, too, all right? Imagine the brain power. Look, Jeff, we gotta go. It's getting late, and you still have three out of the four stages of psychosexual development to get through, all right? Puberty and four easy steps. Miles, don't pay any attention to him, okay? It's never too late to get help, Miles. You too, Anne. <laughs> oh, I think it's very nice, Miles. <laughs> Desperate. <laughs> Of course I was watching the road. So what do you mean, how could it have happened? It was pouring rain. The guy hydroplane right in front of me. I couldn't swerve in time. Guys, we're in trouble. Shh. Dad, it was not my fault. I didn't cause the accident. He crashed the car. How do you expect me to pay for it? I'm just a poor college student. Yeah, but I was gonna use that to pay for my Civil War chess set. I have two more installments. <laughs> Dad, I don't have it. Okay, fine. Whatever. Jeez, so 
sometimes can be so overbearing. Adam, have you ever wanted to sleep with your mom? <laughs> well, I couldn't help but notice a little tension between you and your dad when you were on the phone, and I was just hoping... Well, maybe with your mom. Remember when Professor Hoffman gave us that group assignment? The one where we do our own case study? It's due tomorrow. No. Yeah. No, it's not. Please mm -hmm. say it's not, is it? Yes, no. yes, it is. And I was thinking maybe we could do it on Adam's Oedipal complex. My Oedipal complex? You know, when you want to do the nasty with your mom? I don't know. That's with your mom. Right? Well, wait a minute. Maybe we could do a report on one of the four stages of psychosexual development. Well, we've already covered the oral stage, right? That's none of your business. Well, then what comes next? Uh, the anal stage. Okay. And when does that occur? The anal stage occurs at toilet training time. Kids learn that controlling their bodily functions is a great power trip. But if this process is disrupted in any way, the kid can become anally fixated and uh, basically screwed up. Damn! A nickel in the dime box. Jeez. <laughs> Maybe give me some characteristics of someone who might be anally fixated? Well, he's notably interested in his own bowel movements, has a fear of dirt, is a prude and intently arranging his pocket change by color, weight, and year minted. I think we have something here. What are you saying? What we're saying, Keith, is that you're our subject. You're mainly retentive. <laughs> 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 Great. What does this make me? King of the buttheads? <laughs> no. You're just anal. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. <laughs> Come on. Stop. You are. Look at you. I mean. Ladies and gentlemen, the lovely and talented Kat McCormick. Can you guys keep it down in here? I can hear you all the way down the hall. Yes. We need you for something. We got a problem. Jeff, admitting you have a problem is half the battle. We have to do a Freudian case study by tomorrow. So? Do Jeff. Wait a minute. I think Kat might be onto something here. Didn't Freud refer to phallic symbols a lot? You know, things like cigars, guns, uh, spears. You know, things with that sort of shape. Oh, yeah. Huh? You, uh, enjoying your soda pop there, Jeff? Hmm? Yeah, Freud said that uh, men who are fixated on phallic symbols are insecure about their virility. This is thirst. <laughs> Pure thirst. Ah, yes, but thirst for what? No. Huh? Mm. <laughs> These are toys. Oh, did Mommy give them to you? No, you wasted I'm sorry, but this is a very weak link. And speaking of weak links, how is your love life these days anyway, Jeff? His last date was the missing link. This isn't fair. Aha! More stuff. They're just myth because they're maladjusted. Adam will here wants to sleep with his mom. Your mom. Keith is anal, and I'm perfectly adjusted. Thank you. I know how we can settle this, all right? When you go to sleep tonight... Dream diaries! Exactly. You write down your dreams, analyze them, and there's your project. All right. That probably be a good idea. Sure. Great. Can we go to bed now? Sure, Mom. Oh, oh Millie. Sure. <laughs> now, assuming that the REM dream cycle lasts about two hours, and well, that should give me the potential for at least 3.2 dreams. <laughs> given that the average person remembers approximately 1.75 dreams per night, this project rocks! The clapper. <laughs> I sure hope my mom doesn't find out that I wrecked the car. Why not? No more goodnight kisses. Come on, guys, let's go to sleep, all right? Uh, anal. Oh, Keith, Bertie's playing nicely. What do you 
have here? It looks like a dog, a car, and a house. No, Mommy. That's sodium nitrate, <laughs> monosodium glutamate, and carbon tetrachloride. <laughs> oh. Well, could you make something for Mommy now? Okay, what? Could you make potty? No, I don't want to make a potty. Can you make one now? Oh, good boy, and if you do a good job, I'll give you a special treat. An Erlenmeyer flask? Sure. <laughs> What's that smell? Were you making soap with your Bunsen burner again? No. Well, okay, here. You go to the bathroom, and I'll go turn it off. How's it hanging? Rexel! Oh. Wow! This is amazing, Miles. Can I touch it? Sure. But be careful. It's still a little damp. It's so, so strong, so powerful, so big. Well, they don't call me Miles for nothing. <laughs> it is... An extension of me. How's it here? Oh, Jeff, baby, honey, what do you have? All the usual. Order up, one foot long. What's with Satish over there? He's the first in our Lunch with the Classic series. Oh, I am. What, what, what does he do? Snake charming. Oh, right. Love snakes. look half bad today. I like that tie. Oh, it's so, so big. May I? Please. Oh, feels good. What's the occasion? Got a date tonight. Is she hot? Frida, there's going to be some third degree burns tonight. Oh, really? Yep. And rumor has it that she's a real pushover for guys in ties. So you got all a... Uh... Gussied up and... Tonight's the night, baby! You sure about this now? Yep. Haven't been more sure in my life. And, well, she should be here any minute, so uh, if you wouldn't mind... Oh, I'd... wait a minute. You got, you got some mustard on your tie there. Ooh, mustard. Squirted out of my hot dog. Mm. <laughs> uh, I am invincible. <laughs> Schnookums. Roach face. Oh, it's getting chilly in here. What's the big idea? Well, I was going to tell you later, You've but You've been I telling can't... everyone on campus that I want to sleep with you. I, I may have mentioned that you were attached to... Uh, how could you I'm... spread such blatant lies? Call it priming the pump? You're foul. I never want to see you or your cigar again. <laughs> hey. Nice tie. <laughs> I didn't mean to do it, Mom. The streets were wet. It was raining. I couldn't see. Oh, I just keep going over and over again in my mind with it. Like, 
What if I would have gone a different way? Or what if the brakes would have worked? Or what if Dad had been watching the road? I just couldn't swerve in time to miss him. I know, dear. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Listen, Adam, it was an accident. And if your father was conscious right now, I'm sure he'd be chuckling about the whole thing. <laughs> you feel so awful. Try to calm down. All we can do now is pray and wait for the results of the CAT scan. <laughs> oh, Mom. Oh, Adam. Thanks. I just had one. Hey, guys. Well, it took you long enough. Geez, the project is due at three. Let's get started. Uh... These would be some of Miles' dream paintings, I would imagine. Uh, you know, I think I've had that one. <laughs> Only without the carrots. So, what can I get the little dreamers today? I'll have a, uh, one Impressionist burger. Mm -hmm. Cat, uh, hold the mene. Just give me a Dolly Mel. Any entries in the dream diaries? Uh, yeah, they're actually, we're trying to get them to all down a little bit, uh... Great. A little bit of them, yeah. Can't wait to hear them. Yeah. So, who wants to, uh, talk about their dream first? Uh, well, uh, I had a dream about my youth. Oh, not the one about our third grade teacher and all those sheep. No, shut up. No, in this one... I was a kid, uh, stuck on a problem, and I kept trying and trying to solve it. A little engineer that could. But I couldn't work it out. Finally, just as I was about to can it, um, the problem did work itself out, and I felt a huge feeling of release. That's really inspiring, Keith. Great, thank you. Well, I knew the answer was inside of me. Well, mine was just a uh, simple anxiety dream about my car crash. Yes. And? Well, you saw me last night. I was upset. In my dream, I was worked up as well, and my mom comforted me and made me feel better. That's it? Pretty much. <laughs> Wasn't there anyone else in the dream? Well... No, actually, no. No, sorry, no one at all. <laughs> Tell us about your dream, Jeff. Well, it, it took place here in the cafe, and I was all dressed up, and I sat down, and... Yeah. I, but the, I mean, it was basically, I mean, I was waiting for a date, and, and there was cafe entertainment, and, uh, oh, M uh, Miles was there, and, and Frida, too, and... Do you want me to hold your hand during the scary parts? Uh, and, and then my date came in, and, um... Uh, all right, all right, it was the most phallic dream ever, and it had big snakes and pies and cigars of the works, and, uh, okay, I, I admit it, I, I'm repressed, I'm painfully sexually repressed. <laughs> Good. That's good. Get that down. Don't go away. It's the Varsity Cafe, right after this. <clears throat> okay, here's another sight game for us to play. It's called Word Association. Now, I'll say a word, point to you, and you say the very first thing that comes into your mind. Okay? okay. All right. Sounds good. Now, be totally uninhibited. The trick of the game is not to think. Don't think at all. I could do that. <laughs> Here we go. In. Out. Fast. Uh, C squared. Happy. Sad. 
Old. Mesozoic. <laughs> Boy. Girl. Right. Angle. No. <laughs> yes. What? Relief. Rollways. Accident. Where? Cupboard. Yeah. Insurance. That's, hey, that's great. great. <laughs> well, come on in. We're playing word association. Huh. All right. Okay. Fruit. Veggie. Long. Division. Sugar. Spice. Loud. Soft. Circle. Square. Open. Close. Lock. Key. Bright. Key. Dog. Cat. Cat. Mom. 